particularly in the manned area because their astronauts have been up there over stance. Members of the Pasadena High School band, the Eagle Alliance, will be performing along the route of the inaugural parade, as Mary Ellen Conway reports. Talk about pins and needles, this is one excited group. For months, it's been practice, 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 practice for the boys and the girls in the band. Butterflies abound. I've had them now for the past <laughs> few. It seems like it's coming. We, you know, it's actually here. The closer we get, the more you realize we're going to be in D.C. You know, in a few days. You know, all just very exciting. Yeah. That just pumps us up and gives us that much more energy to make it even that much better. We're excited. Just touch, huh? <laughs> <laughs> no, we're very excited. <laughs> the band will be stationed along the parade route in Washington. Its job to entertain the crowd as well as the politicians and the dignitaries as they head to and from the inaugural ceremonies. Getting chosen from 300 bands across the country was just the beginning. The next big challenge was to raise the money to go. $65,000 for the band alone. The kids worked. They raised money by picking up cans at the rodeo grounds, selling cookies, candy, hams, turkeys. Parents, businesses, and citizens pitched in, too. And the very nicest thing about the whole trip is the way that our community has uh, supported the kids, and we, we really are very proud of Pasadena. <laughs> Going to make Pasadena proud? Of course. <laughs> Try our hardest. No question, huh? No question. <laughs> Pasadena could hardly be prouder. I'm Mary Ellen Conway, 13 Eyewitness News. You have to keep your eye out for them when you're up there. I certainly will. And when we come back, the epidemic of measles has forced a decreased staff to pull long hours in the lab. And the hottest six...